Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is one that I'm really excited to film for you guys because today we are going to be doing my very first holiday Christmas party look. So if you want to see what we end up coming up with, then just continue watching. So starting off with primer, I'm going in with my Vive Skin Nova Instant Radiance Primer. So I'm going to start off with about a pump and a half of that. If you haven't seen it before, this is what the texture looks like. So I'm going to massage that between my fingers and start placing that all over my skin. So for foundation, I'm taking my Dose of Colors Meet Your Hue Medium to Full Coverage Foundation in 115 Light Medium. So I'm going to take about a pump and a half of that on my hand. And then to give the foundation a little bit more glow, I'm mixing in a little bit of my Vive Skin Dew Glow Multitasker. So I'm going to take about that much product. I'm going to mix the two together on the back of my hand using my Dose of Colors Flat Contour Brush. And I'm going to start painting some along my face. And then to further blend that, I'm taking my Dampen Dose of Colors Seamless Beauty Sponge with the rest of the product on the back of my hand and I'm going to start pressing that into my skin. And then for concealer, I'm taking my Tarte Shape Tape Contour Concealer in the shade Light Neutral, and I'm going to start popping some underneath my eyes and along my outer corners on top of my eyelid, between the brow, down my nose, and around the chin. And then I'm taking the same sponge that I use for my foundation to blend that out. And then to set the concealer, I'm taking my Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder. I'm taking this brush right here, which is the Dose of Colors Setting Powder Brush, and I'm tapping that into the powder in the lid. And I'm going to start setting my under eyes. I'm also going to set the center of the forehead, my nose, and the chin. To set the rest of the face, I'm taking the exact same powder on the Dose of Colors Large Powder Brush, and I'm going to start setting the rest of my face. So moving on to the cheeks, I'm first taking my Vive Modern Bronzer Bronzing Duo in the shade Tan. And I'm taking the slightly more cool tone shade on the Dose of Colors Angled Contour Brush, which looks like this. So I'm tapping straight into the pan. And I'm going to start contouring my cheeks. I'm also taking that around the forehead. down the center of the nose, underneath the lip, and the jawline. Going back into the palette, I'm taking the slightly warmer shade on the same brush, and I'm going to start bronzing up my cheeks. Same with the forehead, down the center of the nose, under the lip, and again by the jawline. To highlight my face, I'm taking my Vive Nova Glow Highlighter in the shade Bijou. 
Here is what the shade Bijou looks like. So I'm taking that on my Real Techniques angled highlighter brush, tapping that straight into the highlight. And I'm gonna start highlighting my cheekbones. I'm also taking that above the brow and connecting that through. I'm taking the same highlight down the center of my nose and my cupid's bow. So for blush, we still have three shades of the Vive Sunset blushes. We have Sorbet, Malbec, and Piazza. I think today let's try out the shade Sorbet. So here is what the packaging of the Vive Sunset blushes looks like. And then this is what the shade Sorbet looks like. It is such a beautiful blush color. So to apply that, I'm taking my Spectrum and KJH03 brush and I'm tapping straight into the blush. And I'm gonna start applying that straight onto my cheeks. That blush color is so pretty. I've yet to find one that I don't like. All three shades out of the five have been so pretty so far. I'm also gonna take a tiny bit on the bridge of my nose. So I zoomed you guys in so we can start on the eyes, but I'm starting off with this Vive Eye Wand in the shade Hazelnut. And I'm first gonna run this along the outer corner of my lash line, and then up into a wing. To blend that out, I'm grabbing my Dose of Colors pencil brush and I'm going to start buffing that along the lash line. I'm also going to take a little bit of that on the inner half of my crease. And I'm taking this brush here, which is the Zoeva 223 Petite Eye Blender, and I'm going to start buffing that out. So moving on to powder eyeshadows, I'm starting off with my Vive the Muse palette. This is what the inside of the palette looks like. So I'm taking this brush here, which is the Real Techniques Base Shadow Brush, and I'm mixing Source and Bow. And I'm popping that on the inner half of my crease. Next, I'm taking my Dose of Colors Blending Brush into the shade Peony from the palette, which I haven't yet tried and I'm gonna start blending that shade out. So there's only one more shade that I haven't yet tried in this palette and it's this really beautiful gold here called Finery. It looks so gorgeous, so I thought let's move ahead to the lid shade. So I'm gonna take this brush right here, which is the Zoeva 233 Cream Shader Brush into that shade called Finery. And I'm going to start patting that shade all the way across my eyelid. That color is so pretty and unique. It's almost kind of more of a yellow, orangey tone gold. Next, I'm taking the Vive The Essential palette. So this is what the inside of the Essential palette looks like. So once again, there's actually two shades that I haven't yet tried. So we've got Thea and Delicious. So I think let's take the same brush. I'm going to use the other side and tap into Thea. And I'm going to start layering that on the outer half of my eyelid. And then once again, so we can try the only shade I haven't played with yet, I'm taking the Real Technique Smudger Brush and tapping into the shade Delicious. I'm going to start darkening up my lash line. So next, grabbing a little bit more of the shade Delicious on the same brush. I'm going to redefine that inner half of my crease again. So 
So next, moving on to the lower lash line, I'm moving back into the palette and I'm grabbing my Real Techniques Precision Smudge Brush, which looks like this. And I'm grabbing Delicious and Buff. And I'm going to start smudging that underneath my lower lash line. So to define the upper lash line, I'm grabbing this brush here, which is the Zoeva 317 Wing Liner Brush. And this shade here called Goodnight from the palette. And I'm going to stamp that against my upper lashes and slightly create a smaller wing. So the next step is completely optional, but I thought, what is the holiday season without some glitter? So I'm taking my Dose of Colors and Minnie Mouse Dazzling Eye Glitter. This is discontinued, but any gold glitter will do. So I'm going to start taking that glitter and slightly placing it all over the eyelid. Wow, you guys, that gold glitter is so pretty. I love that it just adds this little hint of sparkle all over the eyelid. I'm sad they don't make it anymore, but I'm pretty sure any gold glitter you guys will have will do. Okay, so to save us some time, I filled in my brows and I did my mascara. So next we've got lashes. So I still have three styles of the Vive Half Lashes left to try. So we have HL1, HL3 Whisper, and HL4 Enhance. So I think today let's try HL3 Whisper. To help me apply the lashes, I'm taking my Vive Lash Applicator Tool. And I'm going to go right ahead and apply my half lashes. So here are what the lashes look like in HL3 Whisper. I've got to say they're probably my favorite style of Vive Half Lashes that I've tried as of yet. They're so wispy and pretty and they don't distract away from the eye makeup. But now that the lashes are on, we've got our lips. So I actually have four shades of the Vive Modern Lip Definers left to try and four shades of the Vive Modern Matte Lipsticks to try. So I think because we're doing a holiday themed Christmas look, let's go right ahead and try out the red combo, which is called Muse. So starting off here is what the Vive Modern Lip Definer in the shade Muse looks like. And then to go with that, here is a close-up of the Vive Modern Matte Lipstick in the shade Muse as well. So I'm going to start off by lining my lips. And then taking the matching lipstick, once again, here's a final look at it. I just love that imprint. I'm going to go right ahead and start filling in my lips. You guys, that is the most perfect red I've ever seen. It is such a beautiful kind of mid-tone red and is perfect for the holidays. You need this. So this is what the finished result looks like with a bold matte red lip. It is so pretty and fun and dramatic and bold and perfect for the holiday season. I feel like a classic red lip will go so far and I think this is my favorite red I've ever put on. But I thought just so we can try something a little bit different, I'm going to take a little bit of this Vive Lip Dew Glossy Lip Oil and pop it right in the center. So taking the Dose of Colors Flat Definer Brush, I'm taking that straight off the wand and I'm popping that straight in the center. And then here is the finished result with a glossy red lip, which I think is also super fun and festive and a little bit more unique. So let me know which one you prefer down below in the comments. I love them both. 
So yeah guys, this is the finished holiday party look for 2021. I am so in love with the finished result. I love the eyes, they're so pretty and sparkly and the lip is just such a fun take on a classic red lip. Let me know if you'll wear something like this down below in the comments. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then you guys know what to do. Please feel free to leave me a like. Comment and leave any requests that you have down below in the comment bar. Subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell and drag it all the way down to all to become a part of this family and be notified of all my future videos. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys. And I'm going to first take the shade. Oh my god, my hands are so slippery. I want to take a little bit of the Vive Lip Dew, la 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 la.